The ACLU has joined a law firm filing a lawsuit against the Central New Mexico Correctional Facility in Los Lunas for the attack of an inmate. That lawsuit claims the two guards forced inmates to beat up Nicholas Milligan. News 13's Jessica Baron has the latest. I find it very troubling that um, employees of the corrections department would stand by and watch an individual get um, attacked by several individuals um, for, a, um, for a significant amount of time. The ACLU released surveillance video they say proves their client was brutally attacked on August 10th of last year. The video from the state prison in Los Lunas was sent to the ACLU anonymously and shows inmate Nicholas Milligan getting beaten as two guards do nothing. The lawsuit says guards Cameron Watson and Jesse Diaz threatened Milligan with physical violence after he refused to grind paint without respiratory and eye protection. The lawsuit claims the officers then coerced three other prisoners to punish Milligan or face consequences. In October, ACLU went before the court's Corrections and Justice Interim Committee asking for more prison oversight. Have somebody who has fresh eyes, an open mind, who is not in any way burdened by some connection to the system of which they're overseeing. Democratic lawmakers like Senator Antoinette Cedillo Lopez and Senator Patricia Royball Caballero were in favor of more oversight. The lawsuit also claims the two officers falsified documentation regarding Milligan's medical treatment, saying no one was injured during the assault. It also says Diaz filed a report indicating there was no video of the incident. Jessica Barron, Caracuy News 13. We reached out to the New Mexico Corrections Department, which said they cannot comment on pending litigation.